This is the newest model of Roomba, the robotic vacuum cleaner that does your housework for you. But these days, Roomba has become more than just a mechanical maid. Many people are dressing up their Roombas and giving them names and genders. Some technically savvy owners are even developing hacks to change their behavior. Here, a Bluetooth interface is attached to this Roomba. Its owner can use a Bluetooth-enabled phone to manipulate its speed and direction remotely. Many researchers are experimenting with new ways for robots and humans to relate to each other. Last month, several teams presented their work at a human-robot interaction conference in Amsterdam. At the University of Washington, computer scientists worked with actors to see how they would interact with this robot. The robot took part in a play, and the team observed how it was incorporated into rehearsals. Could we have, uh, uh, when you address Vatan there, mm -hmm. say Vatan, wait till he turns to you? Okay. And they noted how the audience reacted to the robotic character, and found that they sympathized with it in scenes such as this one. <laughs> Researchers at Victoria Institute in Sweden have created robotic modules that interact with each other using infrared sensors. The way a person shakes each Globot beforehand affects its ability to influence other robots nearby. A Globot will move towards other modules that display different glowing shapes. When two or more of them meet, they communicate and try to agree on a pattern. One robot will either convince the other one to switch designs, or their patterns will merge. Researchers came up with this design by observing how people interacted with unusual pets, like snakes. This robot was created by a team at Brown University and fits in very naturally with humans. It can follow a person and responds to gestures and voice commands. The hands-free interaction requires the robot to be a sophisticated communicator, while humans don't have to do as much. The researchers are planning to improve its perception of depth and texture and to make it interact with groups of people rather than just one user.